up, everyone? It's Mr. Red. I'm a Jack now, and we're playing Civilization V. Let's go. We are going to play a new game. All right, so this is Civilization V, a game where we play as a civilization. So if you've been following our last game, it was Stardew Valley. Uh, we're going to do more of that, but we just haven't recorded any yet, so I'm just doing this in the meantime. Uh, but since we're doing so good at farming in that game, we're going to be farmers in this game. So we got to figure out who who's the best farming tribe. Obviously, it's Japan. So let's do that. Uh, let's just do a huge Pangea. It's probably a bad idea because of the whole um, other people are going to be around. Let's do a huge <laughs> map, but let's make it very easy. All right, here we go. I usually turn off the time-based situation so that we don't run out of time. So we're going to be playing Civilization V today. It's going to be good. I'm 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 into it. Uh, we have so I like this because units fight as though as if though they were at full strength, even when damaged, and it's a lot of fun to have just one guy in your thing fight against a huge uh, army of people. So that's what we're going to do. First, we have to find a place. To, to to lay down or hang up our hat, so to speak. I think I want to do it right next to this gold thing. So let's have these guys do nothing. And we're going to go to the next turn. Boy, I'm excited. I've been wanting to play Civ Five on this channel for a while. I just have not found the opportunity to. But here we go with the opportunity. Let's make a monument. All right. And the next thing we will make is, of course, going to be... How do you get to the queue? How do you get to the queue? Can you do the queue? Show queue. Add to queue. Here we go. All right. Make a worker next. That's what we're going to do next. All right. Cool. So now we will garrison. This is how it's done. So this is what you. This is what I like to do in <laughs> in in this game is just get it to the point where you don't have to do anything and just press next turn over and over again. It's 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 a lot of fun. So we're gonna we're gonna do that. We're gonna do that. We're gonna be the Japan, the farming nation, and I'm into it. Okay, and as you can see, yes, we just grew. We now have two people living in our city instead of just one, which means we could probably do a settler if we wanted to, but. Let's not let's not let's not go let's not go about that all just yet. I believe that one of these gives us a free worker. Is that correct? First for garrison. I don't know about all this, but we want to be a small empire. So let's 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 go for tradition. I hope you guys are familiar, by the way, with uh, this game. I keep wanting to call it Stardew Valley, even though that's not the case. Uh, friggin' what's it called? Civilization. You knew that because I I don't. I don't know that I want to go through every detail to explain it. Essentially, uh, this is basically the prequel to the movie Joker in that I'm constructing a society. And what you're doing is you're just creating a world so we can do all this stuff. Happiness for every 10 citizens. We don't have 10 citizens. Garrisoned units. Hey, cost no maintenance. That'd be good. Yeah, let's do that because I have a garrison unit. It's this one. Next turn. Yes, I love Civilization. I have spent so much time playing this game. I did. So I found out that you could like uh, share a game with another account that you own on the same computer. And in so doing, you will be able to kind of reset your achievements, which as somebody who loves achievements, that's great news for me. Also, I think I have all the settings turned up all the way. So this should look as good as it could possibly look. Yeah, different things you can do. You can found cities. You can have those cities do things like produce stuff, right? Right now, we can do worker or scout or warrior or settler or granary. And they all do different stuff. Granary is a building, not a not a person. You guys knew that. Uh, let's do this one. Provides a free culture building in your first four cities. And they have one. That's fine. We can also research other... We can do uh, uh, science research. Right now, we're doing animal husbandry, which is uh, inappropriate. Oh, it only allows workers to construct pastures. That's... That's fine, then. We'll, we'll, we'll do another research. Let's do... I uh, usually try to go down the line, but let's do the wheel, because the wheel is a good thing to do, especially when you have... Wait, that was the mistake thing. I did a mistake. Oh, well. Uh, yeah, so what you actually want to do is mining, because you can chop down a forest with mining, which I think we're going to want to do. So I'm going to switch. I, I usually don't switch. Once I commit, I commit. But you know what? Uh-oh! Barbs! I don't like barbs. All right, we'll send out our warriors to deal with the barbs. Let's, let's cross this river. Now we're hiding out in the forest. Oh, no. I'm slow. I'm slow AF. 
I'm slow F. Uh-oh. What's, who's that? Who's that up there? Was I see someone's on? More barbarians! No! All right, I attacked him with my city, which is good. Oh, and I got warriors. Okay, I mean, I got workers. Good. All right, so let's let's see what we can do about uh, so the farms. Yeah, there we go. Look, it's happening. We are farmers now. Hum did a lum dum 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 dum. Ooh, ruins. Like, I never I never bother with a scout unless I'm specifically. Wait, what was that? Did you see something? Did I get an achievement and not realize? Isn't it down here? What is this? What is this? I earned an achievement. Treasure hunter. Discover an ancient ruin. I did. I got an achievement. Okay, so. Note to self, achievements are down here. Also, I don't know where my face is going to be during all this, but I usually keep it in about this area, <laughs> and that's not that's not going to work out so well for me here. Maybe it'll be down here or something. Anyway, we're going to choose a production. Uh, what do we want to... I guess we'll go with another worker, right? They don't... Do they, do they cost money? Are they, is there maintenance to workers? Let's see, five... Uh, so minus zero in total expenses. Okay, good. So I have a worker. Wait, what about my warrior? They don't cost anything. They were garrisoned before. I don't understand. All right, well, another worker then. Next turn. Here we go. Here we freaking go. Dude, we are going to just destroy this game of civilization. It's not even going to be funny, actually. I think instead of going to those barbs just yet, we're going to check out these. There's two ancient ruins. I'm going to check out these ancient ruins because they might give us some upgrades in terms of, like, weapons or, like, a freaking culture thing. Boom. Yes. Whoa. I found survivors among the ruins which agree to join your empire as workers. You guys can read, unless I'm right in the middle. I'm not right in the middle. That would be a stupid thing for me to be. Oh, and we can adopt another policy. See, we're doing really great. Monarchy. Uh, this unrest in France will something. I don't know. Uh, let's do, let's just uh, stick with the tile. I'll go with that top down. That's usually, I'll just freaking do it. All right, great. Uh, now what? I guess we can go back. Let's do this one. We'll get there in two turns. It's fine. Uh, these workers though, you should really try to stick with those warriors because they could get themselves got mighty quick. I should get some more warriors as well because I don't have enough. I only have one warriors. That's not nearly enough warriors. Uh-oh, this is exactly what I was worried about. I lost my workers. It's fine, though. All right, you know what? Forget that. Let's just fight these guys. Yeah, I freed them already. Great, that was easy. What was I so worried about? Hey, I got another achievement. It's super effective. I'm an achievement fiend. I'm an achievement fiend. I don't know what I should focus on. Let's do this one, because we can construct a camp and a trading post, which is two good things that I will never use. Well, I might use a camp on, like, these horses or whatever. Uh, but we should also try to get mining at some point, because that gold is going to be something that I want inside me. Actually, I might... Do I have mining yet? I think I might have mining yet. I don't know what to... I'll go over here. Okay. Yes. Hey, I told you. It's literally what I said. I was right. And why can't I hear anything, by the way? So I have this whole thing where I could... Where I uh, did the freak... Whoops. Where I did the... That was my other game. Ignore that. I, I wanted to hear it. I spent so long. All of it's turned down. All of it's turned down. All of it's turned down. I'm sorry, you guys. All right. There we go. Now we can hear. Let's turn the volume up, actually. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. All right, so these guys are free now. Let's go up here. Oh, I don't want to get that close to these warriors. Let's go this. Let's, let's go here. And just wait. Let's just hang out and wait. Play the waiting game. That's what I like about this game is there's just a lot of waiting. What was that? That was a weird sound. Yeah, so I usually don't play this game with sound, so it's gonna be interesting to hear it all happen around me and not understand. Boom, next turn. Yeah, this is a lot of fun. I'm, I'm very excited to be doing this. Yeah, if my voice sounds a little uh, strained, it's because I just finished doing yesterday's episode of the Wurmple Challenge, which was a, whoa! I cleared that encampment enchantment. The Warble Challenge, where I, uh, spoiler alert, beat the game, which was very exciting. All right, we got another worker. Moving on up to the east side. Uh, oh, and look, there's uh, more ruins. Okay, well, let's, let's check out those ruins. Can I check out ruins with workers? Is that a thing that I can do? That might be a thing I can do. Let's make a pasture. I like pastures. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get up here, and then I'm gonna uh, fortify until healed or whatever it's called. 
I'm gonna do one more warrior just because I feel like I need at least one more. I, I never try to do this heal instantly thing because it's a waste of a promotion because you'll heal eventually. I usually try to do rough because I feel like, well, there's pretty open planes here actually. Maybe it'd be good to stick with open. Yeah, let's do shock one. That's a good idea. So I have this really weird thing where I haven't played Civ six yet. I have it. Wow, peace and prosperity, how much achievement? I'm getting achievements all over the place. Wait, this was a mistake. Receive 13 culture. If I had done that and it was in fact the one where I get items, it probably wouldn't have helped me that much. Oopsie. But yeah, I haven't played a, uh, Civ 6 because it seems a lot more complicated than Civ 5. Just not, not complicated like I couldn't figure it out, but just in terms of like, I don't know how and I've never played it before. And usually when I play Civ 5, it's because I'm editing, or I'm watching TV, or I'm writing something that's based on me having to listen to something. Bird beasts and wandering birds do not fall into the same traps or nets twice. Yeah, like I said, I, I usually don't uh, hear this game, so this is very weird for me. But since I know how to play Civ 5, I just throw this on and I can just play it. Whereas Civ 6, I would have to actively learn how to play the game. And I'm not about learning how to do things, so... Boy, I really want that circus. The last game I played, I was being destroyed with happiness. Although right now, I'm doing great in happiness. I think it's high time we make another city. City o'clock up in here. What do we got? We could have, ooh, 10% growth in the capital city and two food in the capital city. That's great. I'm gonna do it right now. Hell yes, dude. Hell yes, dude. I'm a fucking civilization master. You don't even have anything on this. You're sitting at home being impressed with my mad skills. I know it to be true. All right, now what am I gonna do with that particular, these, uh, what are these, spearmen? What are they? What, 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 so yeah, spearmen, my Japanese spearmen. What am I gonna do with them? Cause I don't wanna, they can't garrison in the same city. That would be ridiculous. It's gotta be one garrison per city, yo. Well, I'll have a second city in a second. City. Yeah, because we got we're friggin' uh, six turns, so we'll just uh, wait this situation out. Yeah, just uh, friggin' uh, wait there. Okay, great. I will build another farm, because that's what the name of the game is. You guys just fortify, I don't care. Just just, just friggin' wait. You, you, you'll have stuff to do soon. Don't you, don't you worry about that. Don't you worry your... The haft of the arrow had been feathered with one of the eagle's own plumes. We often give our enemies the means of our own destruction. Ooh, cool. All right, we are making farms. Making farms and taking arms, that's what I say. Let's make the wheel, because we're gonna need that when we uh, construct our other city in three turns. It'll be more than three turns, but you know what I mean. Do you? You do know what I mean, right? Uh, I don't want a trading post, I want a farm! Hell yeah, dude. Boy, we are gonna be well-fed AF. It's not even funny. We're gonna have so many farms, we don't even know what to do with the food that we got for the farms. Also, am I gonna clear these forests in order to do the farms? Yeah, see? I'm already the world's most well-fed peoples. Because of the farms. Because of the farms. Uh, oh, settlers. Yeah, let's go up here. Why? Uh, it progr it pr luxury resources. Hell yes. And actually, why don't you go with them? Because I don't want them to get got by anything. Ooh, Temple of Artemis. In fact, let's do the Temple of Artemis and then let's actually change the construction of the city. Wow, it's a lot. All right, so that's gonna be bad for like, wh what's it gonna be bad for? If we change it to default, Food and I think gold. No, gold is actually better in production focus. That's weird. Well, I guess because we have, this is a great tile to be next to. I made a good choice there. This is also a good tile. Uh, okay, okay, friggin' yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so uh, it's only gonna be ten turns this time because I changed the focus. Boy, I love this game so much. All right, uh, I I meant to stay there and uh, do something, but whatever. Why does it always just? Go where it wants to go, you know? Oh no! <gasps> it will, the current tile improvement will be replaced. I wasted it! Oh well. What is this, a trading post? Yeah, I don't want a trading post. Who cares about that? It gives me one gold and two food. I just want two food instead. I don't want the gold. That's not a farm! It's all about farms here in uh, Civ 5. Stardew Farms. <laughs> oh, the wheel, I got the wheel. Oh, I don't care, I wasn't reading that. Yeah, let's make a farm. Okay, let's make a farm up here. Let's make a, what are you doing over here? Um, can I get there in this turn? Yes. All right, you guys go there. 
All right. What's this? Who's this? <gasps> More barbs. Oh, no. Oh. Better not attack me. They're gonna. They're so gonna. Let's create fishing boats. I like sailing. Sailing, sailing over the ocean blue. That's what I say. Oh, jeez. He's gone. All right, cool. Uh, let's make a farm. How do we make a farm? Boom. Oh, it's gonna minus one production. That's fine, though. We're not about production. We're about farms. Let's uh, skip. And boom, out of city. Osaka, second city. Achievement, achievement. Ah, I always worry I'm gonna do that. And then I did do that. Hey, look, an atoll. All right, let's do a water mill because we're on a river and that's gonna take 17. So why don't we switch? What happens if we switch this over? Oh, we are not gonna have any food, but our production will increase by one. So you know what, it's worth it. And actually, I I'm gonna change that back as soon as this is done to seven. In seven turns, I'm gonna change that back to normal because I don't like messing with it too much. Generally, I leave it at the default focus and call it a day. And I am gonna ride on out with these spearmans. Yes, my Japanese spearmen are destroying these barbs. I'm a barb destroyer. Let me know. <clears throat> Let me try that again. Let me know if you guys are civ masters like I am because I'm a Civ Master, and I want you guys to be two, but you're not allowed to watch this unless you are a Civ Master, because... Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna go out and fight him, because I'm... Oh no! A barb encampment! I don't like that one. Bleh. What? Little. Bleh. Bleh. Uh, so yeah, I... Stop. I am going to eventually be returning to the other games that I have been playing. Uh, namely speaking with fourth, so which to bore for being with, uh, the one called uh, Try to Fall Asleep. Also, the other one, which I know the name of. Oh, I got Master of the House! Dude, how many achievements is that in this one episode alone? Let's find out. Uh, six achievements! I am so close to building a wonder, I'm not sure how, but, uh, them to get got by anything. Ooh! Temple of Artemis, in fact... Let's do the Temple of Artemis, and then let's actually change the construction of the city. Um, but yeah, we're gonna return- uh, Sea of Thieves is the other one. We are gonna return to those. I was trying to play- I tried to play Try to Fall Asleep before, but... For some reason, that game is just giving me so many issues with- It's like- it's- it's like laggy, and it makes my face capture and the game capture all laggy. And I don't like that, so I have to definitely tweak it and do some stuff. I'm not sure how to fix it, but I will fix it. Boom! Oh boy. Hey, Kamikaze attack. Yes, because why? It says, it says, it says, kill an enemy unit attacking with a Japanese unit with just one HP remaining. Dude, I wasn't even trying, but I definitely need to get back and heal because I'm gonna try a thing where I don't lose any of my dudes. Okay, okay. It's not so much for its beauty that the forest makes a claim upon men's hearts. As for that subtle something, that quality of air, that emanation from old trees that so wonderfully changes and renews a weary spirit. It's... it's beautiful. Great, well, I did that. Um, so now I now have um, seven achievements. I have a wonder, which means people are going to be mad at me. But it's not hard mode, so it's fine. Hey, a circus, I want my people happy. Look at how happy they are. Only two unhappiness. By the way, I like how population generates unhappiness. That makes me laugh a lot. Just existing means they're miserable. I'm not gonna be able to farm here, even though I should be. Well, can I even on a hill? I don't know. Uh, let's come, let's come, well, let's do this. Let's do rough now because I always try to keep it balanced. Uh, okay, we built a farm, I guess. You couldn't really tell, but that's that's a thing. Where else can we build a farm? Let's build uh, quarries and farms and whatnot. Let's go, let's go, let's go to Osaka. Let's, let's just, just hang out there. Okay, uh, it wants us to construct a trading post, but I'm super not gonna. I'm gonna do a farm instead. And I can't do a quarry until I have masonry! Ah, and I can't do a farm because it's on friggin' stone grassland river. I can do a farm up here though, and you know I'm gonna. Oh, I should do uh, also the wheel. I have the wheel. I should do roads. But that costs money. And they have plus 11 each turn! Uh, it's fine. Uh, okay, here we go. Ooh, oh no, somebody made the great lighthouse. I wanted to. So teach us to number our days so that we may apply our hearts unto wisdom. Wow, this game is a lot louder than I remember it being. 
Uh, what can we? Let's 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 make Stonehenge. I'm gonna keep this actually on production because I want to build a bunch of stuff. But you, if you're gonna make a watermill in two turns. I can switch it back to default, right? How many turns will that? Only three. Okay, so that's not setting us too back to but some. Uh, yeah, I want to do optics. That optics is good. I like the optics on that. Uh, and then let's 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 see. I don't know. I don't know. Let's friggin' wait until this thing uh, heals himself to full, and then we'll uh, friggin' uh, build a road. Where do we want the road to be? Do we want it to? It's gonna have to cross. Might not have to cross the river if we do up here. Ooh, but we can't. Can we build a river on a tile that we don't own? Is that a thing? I can always buy this tile. Money solves everything, guys. Kids, if you're listening. Money solves everything. Okay, I will construct a farm. Yes, but then I will also construct a road. I can construct a road. Great. Well, I'll just do that then. What? what friggin' what's the big deal? I don't know. But, hey, you know what? Let's do this in the next episode. We're going to... Hey, look, we did everything. Everything's coming up. So, in two days, we're going to come back with more exciting civilization adventures. Two days? Is that correct? Yeah, two days. Two days, more exciting civ adventures. Uh, episode two. It's going to be a lot of fun. We're going to destroy... Probably some barbarians. There's not really, I haven't met any other enemies, and it's easy, so I don't think anyone's going to declare war on us. It's already been turn 30, 47, I mean. This game moves fast. See you in two days, everybody. I hope to see you again. Bye, everyone.